Hello, hello, Lego friends. Matt from Brooksbooks here. Today it's time for a Bricklink haul. Probably got some medieval some realm pieces again. Let's see what we got. Alrighty, got everything opened up and let's take a look at what we got. I'm gonna start with the figures. Ooh, let me open up this one and show you. So like this one here, we got a little princess. <laughs> so I'm trying to build up some uh, medieval figures here because I don't really have any before I start started the space here. So this was really cute. Thought I'd pick that one up for fairly cheap, so I did. Got a couple more as well. And you can tell by the bags, these are actually CMF figures. So let me go ahead and get these guys out. So here we've got, I believe this was an elf maiden. And this is from, according to the back, um, Series 17. It's the one that had um, Dwarf Figure, Muscle Guy, a bunch of other ones, the Rocket Girl, according to the package here. Series 17, there you go. That was really cool. And then the other one, from this is from Series 13, I believe, based on the back here. Figures that came with that. Cool, cool. Evil Wizard. This is the reason for the order at this store. Um, based on what I was thinking about for the medieval realm, I decided I needed an evil wizard, some guy that's going to cause malice over the realm, and here you go. <laughs> this guy is pretty freaking cool. He just looks badass. <laughs> Excuse me, but... So I picked him up at a decent price as well, so a few figures there. Very exciting. Next bag, just a bunch of these 2x2 uh, two two window pieces here, these little panels. Except they're in kind of an arched configuration instead, which is really cool because you can fit a bunch of those window pieces in there, whether you want to use the, the regular style glass panels, or you can use those um, kind of uh, cross-hatched ones too. So I want a bunch of those for potential mocks. And I'm not going to bother taking these out of the bag, just because they're in groups here, but a bunch of these dark tan slow pieces. Bunch of them in brown. These were all pretty cheap, so I figured why not? Why was there? And then a whole bunch of dark bluish gray ones as well. A lot of these will be useful for doing the landscaping and sloping work that I need to do, because I'm going to be doing stuff on mills. And I've done some sorting already as of the recording of this video, but I still need more, so that's what that stuff is going towards. Um, there's more here as well. We've got some dark green, light bluish green. Some dark brown, a whole mix and potpourri of stuff there. And then you see a couple of these panels in here. These are just something else I wanted. They were pretty cheap um, for a future vehicle mock. So that's not part of the medieval realm, but 98% of this, or 99% of this is. Pretty solid haul. Three awesome figures. Lots of great pieces to use for mocking and landscaping going forward and stuff for a vehicle in the future as well. So a quick but simple haul. Lots of great stuff to build the inventory for the medieval realm. Looking forward to it. As always, I hope you enjoyed looking at another little Lego haul. <laughs> I know there's been a lot of these over the last uh, few weeks. But I haven't been going crazy in terms of the amount I'm spending. I'm trying to be fairly efficient with what I'm getting where I can. Um, just because I would need to build up some inventory so I can start doing the castle work and all that good stuff. But as always, thanks for watching. If you haven't, be sure to follow me over on Twitch. That's where I do my weekly live streams. Always looking for more folks to hang out and enjoy those. And if you haven't, be sure to subscribe here. Hit the notification bell. Hit the like button. Leave a comment or a thought below. All that good stuff. Always appreciate it. And until next time, this is Matt from Brooks Brooks saying thanks for watching. See ya. Bye.